Hello ladies and gentlemen, I am Rhinoboy11 and with me today is Mr. Digital Platypus, say hello. Hello. <laughs> hello. And today we're going to be playing a game called What If. Karen is going to give me, giving me some scenarios uh. where I will have to answer either yes or no to that being an actual thing. Um, if you'd like to download this, download this app, it's available on the Play Store. Um, yeah. yeah. So <laughs> let's get into it. What's your favorite scenario? <laughs> what scenario? What if you? It's just turning into me. What if you become twice as attractive, but half as smart? <laughs> I'm already. Would you like not, to be me, I'm Ryan? Not, I, I was, I'm already not smart. <laughs> so that halving my not smart level is going is to that... be like less than if you. Yeah. So. Is this halving your IQ though? I don't know. If you halve your IQ, that's a ridiculous amount. <laughs> yeah. So actually, I would probably say no. I'd rather be smart than... 70% agree with you. Yeah. 70% of people aren't shallow. Yeah. <laughs> right. Next. What if your home was always sparkly clean and all right. duties at home were done automatically? Oh, my God. My room <laughs> it's like a dream. <laughs> my room would be tidy. Yes, please. <laughs> Great. But... You must always wear dirty boots wherever you are. I always wear dirty boots anyway. Yes, that's fine. You're, you're wearing boots now? <laughs> oh, wait, no, because, oh, you mean always wear dirty boots as in even around the house? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Too late. You haven't said you already said it, haven't you? Yeah, 34% said yes. Yeah, I'm an idiot. But then, like, what well, technically wearing dirty boots around your house? That wouldn't matter because everything's sparkly clean anyway. I was gonna say everything's gonna be sparkly clean. Someone come up behind you, scrubbing after you, like <laughs> just chasing you. Yeah. God. What if time passes after you watch your watch? What? What? What if time passes after your watch? What does that mean? What if time Am passes I re after your watch? Is that what it says? Yeah. What if time passes after your watch? As in, like, your digital watch kind of thing. So I guess it's saying your watch is slow? <laughs> oh. What if time... So what if your watch is slow? I, uh, no, but it says, what if your time pass... What if time passes after your watch, but when your watch stops working, time stops forever? Oh, so time is the same speed as your watch. That's... Until the moment when your watch stops. No. Why would you know? That's just saying top will, <laughs> time will stop forever if you... If you break your, your watch. watch. Yeah, if you break your watch. Yeah, so but does that, mean, does that mean you can start and stop your watch? Oh. And you can control... If it was so you can control time kind of thing, but if your watch breaks, then fine. Yeah, I was going to say, is it when your watch breaks or is it when your watch stops? But then, yeah, but then you can never change your battery in your watch, so you technically... And this is like solar panels. <laughs> yeah. No, but I'm, I'm literally asking, is it when your watch stops? Or oh, when it's your watch breaks? When your watch stops. Oh, when your watch stops. Yeah, I'd take that, because that means you could then t technically take out the batteries of your watch. Time is frozen. You do then, whatever it is that you need to do. Finish. The but does that mean you get frozen at the same time? Do you get frozen? Because if you're... <laughs> I don't if, know. If, if you're attached to the time device... You must just screw over the world if you do that, then. Yeah, but I could get my homework done. <laughs> yes, True. put yes. Okay, well, 28% of people agree with you. Well, 28% of people are smart. <laughs> or, uh, yeah, or half as attractive. <clears throat> All right, oh, what if everyone you get attracted to are attracted to you? Okay. But you shit yourself every time you kiss someone for the first time. Oh dear. If you're expecting it. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say. It's only one time. You would, you would literally have to make that say. You you would then have to say, look, I'm really sorry. I gotta go. <laughs> Just run off. But give me a second. <laughs> so I, I, I don't because know. Because normally, normally the first time you kiss, it's normally like a... A quick kiss goodbye or something like that. That's normally yeah. the first kiss. That's normally that was my one anyway. Mm. My one was the first like okay kiss goodbye and then you like poof gone. So technically they wouldn't even know. Yeah. It'd be unpleasant for me or whoever. <laughs> yeah. 
But I mean, like, eh. I, I mean, I'm one of those poor old souls that like that's never like, kissed. Well, <laughs> that's a lie. Um, which was actually covered in an earlier video annotation here. Um, but yeah, no, seriously, I like. I like a lot of people who don't like me back, so it's like, if a lot of people who I liked liked me, I'd be like stuck as to which one to choose. So yeah, so, so like, if you're like, oh, I don't, yeah, but is, is that like, so like just really nice. physically attracted to someone? So like, if you're on a beach and you're like, you see a lot of women yeah. in bikinis, especially if you're on a nude beach or something, yeah, you're screwed. You are pretty screwed, yeah. Um, <sighs> no, I'd say no. That's, that's, yeah. I'm gonna say no. Sorry for hiccups. I can hear. Yeah, sixty-six percent agree with you. Well done, sixty-six percent of the people who played this game. Ooh, what if you had a magic carpet? Okay, so basically I'm Aladdin. <laughs> but you are not allowed to get off it. <laughs> that's fine. Who, who, fine. Who cares? I can fly you... into my room and go on my computer. Yeah, it's not a problem. You can't. But I'm. S like, I'm on a carpet, actually. So. <laughs> I'm on a carpet. I'm so... on a carpet. Take a good hard look at the Dude, chill. <laughs> chill. Yeah. Okay. Um. Right. Yeah. Uh... Uh, yeah, that'd be fine. Yeah. Yeah. What's twenty-nine percent of people agree with you? Well, in that case, seventy-one percent of people be stupid. Yeah, definitely. Uh, what if, uh, what if there was peace on Earth? <laughs> you're not gonna, know. you're not gonna like this, but, but internet disappeared. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just answer this one for you. It's forty nine, forty nine percent. Well, that's, that's pretty 50-50. That's really close. That's like YouTubers versus people who have lives. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What if you learned everything there is to know about any two programming languages? That's oh, pretty... Oh, <laughs> that's decent. Here we food. go. Here we go. Ah. ah. Future print games programmer coming in. <laughs> right. <laughs> But you inherit 12 chickens, a horse, and a pair of pigs on a farm. You have to take care of yourself. I'm sorry, you... But if I knew two programming languages fluently, I could make a game, make loads of money, hire someone to look after my pigs and sheep for me. I wouldn't care. Yes. I love animals. Animals are great. Yeah, but 12 chickens, a horse, and I guess you could ride the horse. Yeah, you could ride the horse. You could get eggs off the chickens. You could get bacon off the pigs. Sorry, everyone. But That's yeah, yeah, but you have to take care of them. You don't have to freaking murder them. Why not? <laughs> That's not taking care of them. Well, it is <laughs> taking care of them in another sense. Uh, if you say so. <laughs> yeah, well, forty percent, forty one percent agree with you. Ah, oh, well done, forty one percent. Ryan. Oh God. <laughs> Who's your best friend? Don't put me in this. Because. <laughs> Okay, I'm not gonna who's, say you. Who's your best? Yeah, who's your best friend, friend, Ryan? <laughs> who's my best friend? Okay, I've got him in mind. Just read the okay. question. What if you become a Jedi Knight? Right. But your best friend becomes a Sith Lord. <laughs> <laughs> this is the whole Luke, I am your father kind of deal. Um, <laughs> yeah, I'd probably like to kick his ass. Actually, yeah, that'd be fine. <laughs> Yeah. Forty one. Actually, no, actually, no. Let's be. Oh honest. wait, I was just <laughs> fine. Let's well, forty one said yes. Yeah, if you were my friend, I'd probably be okay with that. <laughs> All right. Mainly because Jedi always wins. Uh, what if you could become the next king slash queen of Sweden? Why Sweden? Because amazing internet connection. Duh. That Carry is on. true. But you had to marry a person of royal blood. Wait, hang on, wait. So to become king or queen of Sweden, I have to marry a princess? Of Sweden, probably. Of yes. Sweden? 
Princess I, of Sweden. To, to be quite honest, have you seen Swedish women? I have not. Hold on. No, I have. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone has. Yeah. Like, uh, that's... Swe Swedish volleyball team. Like, goddamn. Yes, you obviously would. Yeah. So yes is the answer. So yes. So fifty-seven percent agree. So. Why only fifty-seven? There should be more. I don't know. Maybe they just don't think about the princesses. Yeah, they don't think about the gosh darn smoking prin princesses. That's it for now, guys. Thank you very much for watching <laughs> this video. If you like it, please leave a like, a comment, and a subscribe. I'm gonna work through that. I don't even care. Calm's dying. Um, if you'd like to say goodbye before you die, calm. That's great. Goodbye. <laughs> and we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.